a moment of remembrance for KJ Stimson, who passed away a few weeks ago. His fellow street stock drivers start us off. Rookie Amber Lynn on the point with Brian Sykes second. But off the green, Lynn spins, taking Brian Wall with her. Brian Sykes leads the rest of the way and takes his first ever street stock win over Spencer Martin. Twin 25 lappers for the Modifieds, Lee Jeffries is fastest and starts number one. Lap 20, Michael Clifton's tire goes flat. Lee Jeffries holds off Burt Myers for his first win since 2015 and also his first win without his dad, Robert Jeffries. He is my best friend. We is together every day and uh, people just don't know what it's like to miss him. Uh, every day I go out in the shop, you know, it's just a loss that you don't have somebody there. Uh, that makes it easier when we win for him because that's what it's about. 100 laps for the sportsman, John Holloman, the fourth fastest and draws the pole. Lap 16, Kyle Southern and Zach Orspin. Lap 66 off a restart, Dylan Ward somehow saves his car, running down pit road to avoid a crash. Lap 83, something breaks on Zach Clifton's machine and he spins. John Holloman leads 93 laps, but off a crazy cone restart, Michael Adams muscles his way to the point. Derek Stoltz follows. It's a thrilling win for Michael Adams. How did you muscle your way past John Holloman there? A little luck with my crew on the radio pumping me up. That was the most fun race I've ever been in. Well, if there's hard feelings, he can get over it because that's racing, baby. Bonus fan cam coverage of the second mod race. Mike Norman starts up front with Junior Miller second. Lap three, Norman spins on the backstretch. Junior Miller beats Joe Ryan Osborne to the checkers. Miller retakes second place on the all-time wins list with his 74th career win. We had a good night. Uh, that's what we needed to win one this year. Did you just tell the crowd that this was going to be your last race and you're going to go out a winner? I'm going to go out a winner. I think so. I may not be back, but, uh, you know, we'll, uh, we'll see what happens. At Bowman Gray Stadium, Jeff Amernick, WXII, 12 Sports.